As you know, I'm very proud of working here at CBE Learn. So I thought what I'd do is just give you a little bit of a tour so you can see what it's like when students come to our building. Now, most of the students' work is done online. However, we do have a physical building located at Lord Shaughnessy High School. Now, we share this building with a number of other programs. We have Chinook Learning Services. We also have the Career and Technology Center. Now, that's where students can take things like auto body or welding or pre-engineering to supplement the work they do. Now, in the CBE Learn office, this is where students would come in if they have an appointment with a counselor or if they need a textbook, something along those lines. This is my office here. So even though the majority of my work is done online through discussions and emails, telephone calls, I do have a physical office. This area is where students would come if they need to register for a course, if they need to pay a fee, pick up a textbook, or get their photo ID taken. Now about 75% of our students do attend another school. So for the 25% that attend our school only, we need to take their picture so they have photo ID. Right across the hall is a teacher center where many of our teachers work from on a fairly regular basis. Teachers have the freedom to work from home as they like. However, we find that many teachers choose to come and work on site. That way they can have access to resources we have here, including the best resource of all, each other. We try and keep things lively and bright in the area where we have students. Like any other school, we have a student services department. This is where students and parents would meet with a guidance counselor or the academic advisor. At CBE Learn, we have two academic advisors and one guidance counselor. Lots of resources, materials for students. One thing you'll notice on many of the doors in many of our spaces we highlight that we have welcoming, caring, respectful, and safe schools. It's something that we do truly believe in, and we know that we need to make our spaces safe for all students. We've made sure that there's good signage throughout the building because we know with our online students, many of them only attend our building once, and that's to write an exam. Students do have interactions with their teachers. They do build relationships with their teachers, but they don't often see them face to face. Everywhere you look, we try and have signage to help students find their way. One thing we need to remember is that these students don't have a usual. They haven't been here before.
we do have an elevator in the building because we want to make sure things are accessible for all of our students. The one place students come the most is the CBE Learn Testing Center. Again, lots of signage and information for students, including a message letting them know we care about them. Once or twice a semester, students will come into the test center to write exams. Now, most of their work is done online, but there are mandatory face-to-face -face requirements. Rather than have a completely sterile environment, students on our leadership team came up with the idea to put some color in here. They got together and found the fabric for some of these chairs, hung some artwork, made sure there were some plants and some life in here. even made a great painting for the wall. So although we know that our students work online, and that's where they meet their teacher, this is one of the only physical spaces the students come into. We make sure that they have water, to stay hydrated, a number of fans, especially in the summer, keep things nice and cool. Warm colors, encouraging messages, and everything that we can do to make sure that students are as successful as possible. Now, thank you for this little tour. As always, if you have any questions at all, please, please don't hesitate to ask me. I love my job, I love my school, and I love talking about it.